Let us go to another theorem. Equal parts of a circle are equidistant from the center. So OP is perpendicular, it's a distance, and OQ is also a distance, and AB and CD are equidistant means OP, the distance between O and the card, distance between O and this card are equal. So now what is given? For proving, we need to join cards. Now take two triangles. Triangle BPO, this side, and triangle CQO. Okay? Our target is to prove OP is equal to OQ. So now let us list out the equal cards. OB, OB is equal to OC radius. Okay. Now we know AB is equal to CD. This is given. So half of AB, if you divide it half, that is because both sides we are dividing it with half. Half of AB is nothing but BP and half of CD is nothing but CQ. They are also equal from the theorem. Perpendicular bisects the third. We have learned just previously the perpendicular from the center bisects the third. So OP, OP and OQ bisects these two equal cards. Therefore, BP half of AB, CQ half of CD are equal. And uh, uh, what else? 90 degrees. Let us write 90 degrees also. Because only this is 1 and this is 2. We need 3 parts, 3 equal parts to show two triangles congruent. So now, what are the third part? Angle BPO is equal to angle CQO is equal to 90 degrees. This is also given. So, what property? Right angle, hypotenuse and side. So, triangle BPO is congruent to triangle CQO by RHS congruency rule. Therefore, OP is equal to OQ. This is CPCT and also that is what we require to 